Hey, what's up YouTube and my GPK fam? It's your boy Retro Hero back again. Have another one of those videos today. If you remember, it was late January, early February. We busted into a 2020 late to school collector's box. Now in that box, we got that lunch pail. What's up lunch pail? Pretty sweet. We got a smoking Joe autograph, but I wanted to take you back doing something less current. Um, hmm. See, 1985, 86, hmm, got some buttons, nah. Let's see, 87, 88, hmm, 2003, original series one chrome, 2013 tops, yeah, 2013 was a pretty good year, wasn't it? I mean, Chrome came out for the Garbage Pail Kids. It's sealed. Let's rip this sucker open and see if we get some hits. Before we get to ripping that uh, Chrome First Series Garbage Pail Kid Hobby Box back there, I wanted to ask you so kindly to go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. This time, leave me a comment. Out of someone that likes, subscribes, and leaves me a comment, I am going to do a giveaway. I'm going to do this Gold Dusk Snake Pit Pat card. It's absolutely beautiful. I love the gold border. The colors in this card is stellar, and on the back, as you can see, it's number 25 of 50. So, someone lucky out there will win this card. All you have to do is hit that like button, subscribe to me, and leave me a comment, and I will contact you, and we'll send that off to you. Uh, 2013 Tops decided to roll out their Series 1 cards under the Chrome logo. They're beautiful cards. If you're a Garbage Pail Kid collector, with the exception of maybe the first couple of series, you probably love Chrome, especially if you're into the more modern stuff. And uh, I've, I've had a couple of these hobby boxes. I've tore a couple open, I had some sets. Um, I still have a complete set of these. I'm still about GPK in a budget. So I've had this box for years. I have saved it for a long time, but it's time to open it and why, well, because the elusive hits that you can get from a box of original series Chrome, I mean, they're stellar. You have Super Fractors, which are one of each character. Um, the Holy Grail, as far as the Chrome series goes. Uh, you have a, a whole bunch of Refractors, which are beautiful cards. And then of course you have Artist Autographs and the elusive printing plates in here. Even the C name short print cards are really cool. Now the chances of getting one of these super, super slim, that's what makes these boxes so desirable. And again, I mentioned it before, GPK on a budget. I've had the box for years. Now they go for two, 250 on eBay, but we're gonna break this open and hopefully we get a big hit live. In fact, I am expecting to get a hit, so I got out one of my Ultra Pro One Touch, um, holds 35 point cards. It'll be fine for Chrome. They fit nice and snug in here. So that is just for that uh, Super Fractor that we're gonna get, right? And then of course I have a couple of just the submission sleeves. So we get a cool card, um, a nice type of refractor, an artist autograph, uh, printing plate. We'll go ahead and slide it into one of these. Um, as you can see, I expect to get a lot of hits out of this box. So yeah, let's, uh, let's jump right in and tear this sucker open. Now let's go ahead and set these aside. Hopefully we'll get something to put into those and we'll put that, uh, gold dust 
snake pit pad up there that someone's gonna win. Let's tear this open. So I'm gonna take it back here and carefully open the box. Uh, don't have the safety scissors tonight, so <clears throat> don't wanna cut my finger and I won't. So we got that open, throw that away. I'm gonna set this right here. I did have to turn off the light on the camera because Chrome series cards are so beautiful, you have to wear shades. So um, we'll keep the box nice because, well, hey, Boxes are still valuable, aren't they? Uh, Garbage Pail Kids Chrome comes with four cards. Look for GPK pencil art. So I've got a lot of those in the past. Um, absolutely beautiful pink foil wrappings. Let's tear one of these. Oh, before we do, let's look at some of these odds. So, um, going to be hard to see. So, I'm going to read these to you. Super Fractor is one in nine, almost 10,000. Printing plate is one in 2,500. I'm rounding up here. Uh, Redemption is one in 21,900. Um, no one really knows what the C name short prints are, but let's open up our first pack. So tear right into this first one. Such beautiful cards, iconic series. Uh, flip this over, very right out of the gates. Uh, Adam Bomb, I also see a refractor or a pencil art card in there. So um, Adam Bomb, beautiful card, as you can see um, the back of these. Just absolutely gorgeous. Look at the sheen on these chrome. That's that's why I love chrome. Um, it is a refractor and it is Global Warren. Uh, Global Warren refractor, um, just a standard refractor of the Lost. Uh, it says refractor up there as you can read. Beautiful card. So we have a re our first refractor from our first pack. So let's set him up there. Um, Arachnid and Stormy Heather. Very, very beautiful cards and I'm excited to be sharing this with you guys tonight. I know uh, some of us are thinking about Chrome 3 uh, coming out here this summer, and, and I really hope I really hope Tops does that. Um, I will definitely be picking up a couple of those. So Junk Food John, there he is, uh, gorgeous, gorgeous card. Um, got our looks like our second refractor missing Link, uh, lost refractor up there. So second refractor missing Link. Um, Drunken Ken and Dead Ted. Uh, I love the moon and Dead Ted. Let's see if I can get that. It's kind of a a silver and gold color together. Absolutely beautiful. Pack number three of the 2013 Chrome Series wines. Here we go. We're looking for that elusive hit. And is it in this one? I, I just don't feel it. I don't think it is in this one. But we'll flip it over. Dead Flora. Again, Lost, Tommy Tomb is the pencil art. And you got Up Chuck, my boy Up Chuck. What's up? I love this card. Just outstanding. And Graffiti PD. Beautiful cards. I don't normally put the uh, pencil art cards. That's a nice subset, but I don't uh, put them in cases to protect them. I just have them in either a nine pocket holder for my set or one of those 50 or 100 card holders. Uh, Creepy Carol, there she is. Beautiful card. Love that gold background. There's our third refractor, Wacky Jackie. Um, I just love the rainbow on these. Very cool. Uzi Susie and Raisinella. <laughs> do, do you guys remember the California raisins from the 80s? Uh, I'm assuming most of you out there are my age, right? So those are heard it through the grapevine. Okay, so I probably lost one of my 14 subscribers right there. <laughs> All right, next pack. I think that's pack number five. We've got <laughs> Will Hung. I love these lost. Uh, <laughs> no wonder this didn't get approved by the artist. Uh, there's our other refractor, Bad Brad. Bad Brad, cranky Frankie brother. Beautiful. Um, I'm just going to start stacking these up there. Uh, Damage Don, I, I, I love this card. It, it's iconic, and it was done really well, really well. John Pound, such a good artist. And then, of course, Art Apart. Funny story about Art Apart. He is the very first card that I have ever purchased that was um, graded. Um, I didn't send it in to get graded, but it was a really good price on an auction. And, well... 
I bid on it, got it for the minimum bid, and he was my first Garbage Pail Kid graded card. I've had him for years. Um, I don't even know what the grading service is on our, our parts, but uh, I've never heard of it before. But it's still a graded card, and it's pretty cool to have. Nerdy Norm right there, Nerdy Norm. Pencil art for Uzi Susie. Ray Decay, Ray Decay, Junk Food John's brother, and New Wave Dave Graffiti Petey's brother. So really, really good art. Now, as a kid, um, I remember buying these and opening for the first time. A uh, buddy of mine, we'll, he'll, we'll just call him J.S. I, I won't name drop him, but uh, <laughs> he had these cards at his house, and I was like, man, where did you get those? And he's like, I got them at the quick shop. We were up playing video games. I think we were playing Gauntlet. I could be wrong. Um, but that's where I got them. And sure enough, I ran up to quick shop. Well, I wouldn't say run. I, I rode my bike, my 10 speed up to quick shop and, and bought a bunch of packs. And then I came back the next day and bought more. And then the next day and then the next day. And, but that's what we did in the summer. We went up to quick shop and we played a bunch of video games or pinball and we drank and ate, uh, drank soda, ate hot dogs, and bought garbage pail kids. Nasty Nick, there he is. Iconic 1A card. Um, valuable because, well, a lot of us kept these in rubber bands, and he was always on top, right? Uh, pencil art for Fry and Brian. A lost card, finger painting Fifi. That is, uh, <laughs> yeah, I... <laughs> I wonder why that one didn't make it in. You know, we say that now, but I mean, here's Mean Gene. You got Mean Gene, you know, he's got dynamite and, and a machine gun. And we're finger painting Fifi was, was too much, but Mean Gene wasn't. Um, all right, here's our next pack. So rip that open. We've got a lost card on the back. That's generally good luck, right? Looking for that elusive super fractor, brain plate, artist autograph. Uh, electric Bill. <laughs> Uh, lost card slam sloan i don't know if this didn't make it because it just wasn't <laughs> it just wasn't uh as iconic as the other well they didn't know it'd be iconic at that time right guillotina and <laughs> libby stick okay <laughs> some of these lost cards man i, I gotta tell you what they are they are uh, there's some all right so next pack Still looking for our hits. Uh, we got Alan Al. Uh, looks like this one is a refractor. Corroded Carl. Really nice card. <laughs> Corroded Carl could make it in, but Libby Stick was too much, huh? Buggy Beggy. Buggy Betty, excuse me. All right, so let's... Uh, oh, this one. That one That one feels... This, this one feels different feels like a winner so let's see weird windy and the refractor for bad art <laughs> and you got al apocalypse and scary carry you know uh this is why i don't gamble guys because you know I don't, I don't really know what a winner is uh all right next pack harry mary Harry and Mary for the pencil art, Pickled Pete, and Flat Pat. I like Pickled Pete. I always like Pickled Pete for a card. Ripping open our next one. Here we go. <laughs> Noah Parkin. Geeky Gary, TV Stevie Brother, Slimy Sam, and Booze and Bruce. <laughs> I loved this card when I was a kid. So, Booze and Bruce. Drunk Ken. So that means that Drunk Ken's going to be one of these here pretty soon. That seems to be the theme. <laughs> Keep out Keith out. Vaporize Val, Itchy Richie, and Stitch Stella. Still looking for a different type of refractor or an artist autograph. Something out there. A C name would be neat too. All right, so we've got Sicky Vicky, we've got Mean Gene. Mean Gene is going to be your pencil art. Fetid Fern. <laughs> Fetid Fern and Crater Chris. So, all right. Next pack we got here. This will be the winner, right? 
Come on, winner, winner, chicken dinner. And we've got a lost card on the back. That's always a good sign. Jesse Jesse. That means we got Boney Joni for a refractor. Boney Joni, very iconic card. Should go down there. Tommy Toom and Duncan Duncan Duncan. Duncan Duncan. Okay, so next pack. Here we go. Open this sucker up. We should have brought some scissors. Kim Kong, Leaky Lou, Refractor, beautiful card. Beautiful card, Leaky Lou. Prickly Pete and Green Jean. Opened a lot of fat packs and, and multi packs of these, and they typically come with one pencil art per. I haven't seen a lot of pencil arts in this hobby box. Um, Run down Rhoda and Savage Stewart pencil arts, very nice. Great Vi and Mad Mike. Again, beautiful cards. Uh, if you're asking how many of these hobby boxes do you need to open to get a full set, um, I had to open two out of my original. There's a checklist back there. I had to open two because that's how many I, uh, packs I needed to get a full set. So Junkie Jess, Jeff, uh, Blasted Billy, um, pencil art card. Look at the, the, the art on this. Wow. <laughs> it's kind of different. Chili Millie, and there's Blasted Billy right there. So absolutely iconic, beautiful card. Still looking for that Super Fractor or a comic or C name or printing plate or artist autograph. Here we go. Thin Lynn, Wrinkly Randy, Jason Basin. I love this card. And Bug Burt. He looks so happy. That Garbage Pail Kids, they were absolutely adorable. Um, I mean, they're, they're in just vicarious situations, uh, but <laughs> they're all happy and adorable and and very cute. And that's been lost, and, and I know to each of, of his own for the art um, or for the artist, but um, how adorable they were. I mean, just let's, let's take a look at Brainy Janie here. Look at that look on her face and that tooth. They're very, very cute. Um, Formaldehyde Fred, Swell Mel, and Mauled Paul. Got a lot of art of Mauled Paul. Beautiful card. And I think we've got three packs left. So one, two, three. What do you guys think? Is there going to be a hit in here? Are we going to pull something live where it's going to be amazing? Let's see. Here we go. Spacey Stacy, J to K. Beautiful card. Haggy Maggie and Potty Scotty. So not in one, that one. Two left. So here we go. We're going to open this one up. It's never in the last pack, right? Okay, so Jenny Genius, Rappin' Ruth, Frying Brian, and Virus Iris. <laughs> okay, last pack. Here it is. The box is empty. As you can see, it's just got the cardboard in the box. So that's it. We'll put that back in there. Love, love, love the Chrome first series. Super excited. Tops, if you're watching this, for Chrome Series 3 to come out. Tops, if you want to make us happy that we're stuck at home, uh, why don't you put that sucker out so we can spend some of that stimulus check on Chrome 3. Okay, last pack. We're opening this up. And here we go. Looney Lenny. Virus Iris. Pencil Art. My boy, Fat Matt. You got Fat Matt over there. And Drippy Dan. So, well, I don't know if you call this a bust or not. Uh, what did we pull? Five, six, seven, eight refractors. So let's go through what we have for some beautiful refractor cards. Um, no Super Fractor, no X Fractor. Well, I think X Factor only comes in the uh, fat packs, or, or excuse me, the uh, the blaster boxes. Um, no Atomics, but we got a Corroded Carl Refractor. Very nice. Boney Joni. 
absolutely beautiful. Licky Lou, Global Warren, Bad Brad, Bad Art, <laughs> Missing Link, such a cool card, and round it off with Wacky Jacky. So that is what we pulled from our Chrome Hobby Box. No, again, stellar hit. Not that I was expecting that anyway. I hope you enjoyed the video. Again, please make sure you hit the like button, subscribe button, leave a comment. I'm going to pick a lucky winner for this Gold Dust Snake Pit Pat card, number 25 of 50. So one of you will win that. Thanks so much. This is your boy Retro Hero saying everyone stay well out there. Bye.